Let us go through the functions that can be used to deal with Unix timestamp. Unix timestamp is nothing but an integer which started on 1970 January 1st and incremented by 1 every second. We can leverage the extract with the epoch or date part to actually convert Unix epoch to regular timestamp. To underscore timestamp can be used to convert timestamp to Unix epoch. We can get Unix epoch or Unix timestamp by running date plus percentage s like this on Unix or Linux terminal. You can see here, this is the integer which belong to the current timestamp. Now we have to convert this to regular date or time. For that, we can leverage the two underscore timestamp which we'll be seeing at a later point in time after exploring extract to get the regular date or time to Unix time within Postgres database. First, we need to load this SQL magic. Then we have to create this environment variable called as database underscore URL. Now we should be able to run this which will return the integer which is nothing but this one for current date. Current date is nothing but 2020 November 22nd and this is the epoch for that. You can also use date underscore part for the same purpose. You just have to pass epoch like this as a string in single quotes and then the date from which you want to get the epoch. You can also get it from the timestamp. However, as we are passing string here, one of the way to typecast it to timestamp is this colon colon approach and this will take care of converting this to a standard time and using that we are using extract by passing epoch from and we are able to get the epoch for this time. You can also run this to convert the epoch to standard date or time. You can see the time here because we have used to underscore timestamp. To underscore date cannot be used for this purpose. Only to underscore timestamp supports the conversion of epoch to regular time or date. If you want to convert to date, you have to typecast to date like this. It will take care of converting only to date by discarding the timestamp. You can also use this approach. You can say to timestamp epoch, which will return the timestamp. Then we can use to underscore care function to get whatever information we want from that uh, timestamp. In this case, I am trying to get only the year and month as integers. That's why I am running uh, this one and you can see the output here. If you remove this and if you run this, even though it is returning the same thing, this is actually of type string or care. To typecast, we can say colon colon int like this and we should be able to typecast to integer. This is how you can actually convert Unix timestamp into regular timestamp or date and vice versa. You need to use extract with epoch or date underscore part to get the Unix timestamp and you have to use two underscore timestamp to convert the epoch to the regular date or time.